Hey, good morning, everybody. Welcome to another Daily Market Report brought to you by Mike Bjork. And today is Tuesday, January 8th. And I, I, like I said yesterday, it's going to be a light week this week, so today's no different. We do got one economic news release scheduled for today, and that's the uh, Small Business Index, NFIB Small Business Index, Index for the month of December. And uh, for the month of November, we had 87.5%. Uh, growth and they, it was a slight increase of about a half uh, to 88 for the month of December. So a little bit better. That what this is is a gauge of what the feelings of the economic outlook based on the small businesses out there. What they're seeing if they're feeling a little bit more confident. It's kind of like a confidence uh, index. Uh, if they're feeling that the economy is improving or worsening, these type of things on the small business side. So we'll jump over the headline news here today. And right now the stock market is currently down. And a lot of it today is uh, it's not so much the small business index that's kind of reporting more, more on the technicals. And we got basically some earnings reports being released now for uh, Q4 of some of these uh, retail stores and some you know, different businesses out there like Alcoa is giving reportings today and some other businesses. So that's what's kind of driving the market today. Now we'll jump over to the bond market see what interest rates are doing. And as you can see, we're getting this a pattern here, improvement here. So we had this uh, last week, as we had mentioned, we had the... Fed released their minutes uh, in the afternoon. We had an emotional roller coaster ride all the way down. And then we even started the day the next day lower and we came up. And now we got a little bit of a rally coming up. So right now we're getting kind of a more sensible trading right now, as this was these were based off of uh, emotion and then that kind of wore off. And now we're getting back, uh, getting, gaining some of that back. And you're seeing an improvement in the interest rates. So when we're quickly approaching the 100 day moving average as well as the 10 day moving average. Uh, we're fighting against this ceiling here so once we get up above here this could form a ceiling here it could be a little bit more difficult to penetrate uh if we can get a nice little rally again boosting it up you know it could help us out here and we might be able to trade back where we were before around the 104 80 ish 105 range all right so we got improvement in the interest rates which is great news here uh we're currently up about 12 basis points on the fannie mae uh coupon so uh, thanks for stopping by. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. I will keep this short and sweet for you folks, and we will see you guys tomorrow. And thanks again. If you guys like to see these on a daily basis, just stop by mikesdailymarketreport.com, subscribe, and we'll have these emailed to you on a daily basis. Have a great day.